is going on it's your boy warner brother and we are back with some more need for speed no limits time for episode 266 for day five part two of the lamborghini countach lp 5k qv proving grounds live event let's get into it and today we have a special guest all the way from nowheresville we have b Brandon. what's going on y'all yeah buddy it's been a while since Brandon been on the channel. It's good to have him here, have him back. Him and his mediocrity. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so let's check out the Pro Store right away. And, ooh, wheel segment that we will go ahead and grab. That's really nice. Day 101 of me torturing my audience using wheel jokes. And let's head back into day five. We have elimination. So... Uh, currently, we still need a performance rating of 538 in order to get to the final race. We're currently sitting at 536, so only two more points of performance, uh, which we might be able to do right here. At least one more point right here. Yeah, there we go, 537. So literally, we need just another material or two in order to get to the performance rating we need to. So we have a drift time challenge, a rush hour race, an air time time challenge, and another rush hour to end day five. Let's get into it. So motor upgrade kit, something we actually won't be needing for quite a while and something that I'll probably just be getting rid of just because we won't be needing it for quite a while. So we need to drift 800 yards and finish in under 28 Point seven six seconds. Sounds good. Let's get into it. Oh, look at that thing. Triple white, just like Miami Vice. Sorry, not Miami Vice. Wolf of Wall Street. The difference between this one and the one on the movie is the body kit was a little bit more Americanized. I say Americanized because back in those days they had regulations where you had to have bumpers sticking out a certain distance and you had to have these type of fenders and yada 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 all for and all in the name of safety. But in the realm of need for speed, we don't care about safety, am I right? I'm right. Alright, so finishing in under the time limit and drifting I actually almost doubled the amount that we needed to drift. Good stuff. So that motor upgrade kit is something we can sell. We get, I believe, 500 credits for it. Not bad, not bad at all. Next up, we have a rush hour race ECU segment. That will definitely be useful. Here we go. A little bit of lag, but it's starting to clear up. There we go. Time to line them up and time to let them rip. Here we go. Almost had the perfect launch. Just barely missed it, but a good launch is good enough. Yikes. Oh, what is that? What kind of dirty driving is that? Okay. Right, that's what I thought, boy. Can't drive like that on me. And across the line. Can't handle dirty drivers. Barely won that race. Saw how close that was. That was less than three tenths. So about like a car length and a half, I think. Mm -hmm. Next up, an airtime time challenge. Basically a time trial, but you have to do the matching or you have to match the amount of hang time from the jumps. Which, 5.6 seconds and a time limit of a minute 14 And we're definitely on the mountains for this one, so. I think we can get it under a minute 10 if we do it right. Here we go, lining it up, let it rip. Here we go. 
Over rev, that's not how you start off a run. And big air. Decent air. Another decent one. That's a good one. Uh, that was mediocre. Here's where the really big air comes in, right here. 1.1 seconds, that's good. Go a bit wide, cut back in. And nitro, and there it is. And just because I could, I'd hit the final jump there. Whoa, a little bit off the wall there. All right, time to pick the speed back up because we did lose quite a bit of speed in that middle section from bouncing off the walls. Scraping the wall there a little bit. Oh, this is gonna be close and across the line. So didn't get the time that I was looking for, but still finished under the time limit. And seven seconds of hang time. Not bad. Alrighty, transmission segment. That'll be a good addition to the car. Now we have the final race left to do, and now's a good time to go ahead and add these materials into the car. So, transmission segment. All right, that didn't get us to the PR level. Will this do it? The ECU segment. All right, 538, perfect. This is exactly what we needed performance-wise. So, final race, rush hour, wheel segment. Again, wheelie nice. So this is gonna be a pretty interesting battle. Going up against three, well, three opponents in two different JDM Legends. Is that a Supra? Yes, it is. Very much so. Lining them up, letting them rip. Here we go, up and down the mountain once again. Good launch. Didn't get the perfect launch. But still good enough. Catching up to those Nissans, get down on the inside, getting cut off. Oh my goodness, I'm really getting cut. What was that? What kind of dirty A driving was that? Okay. Move. Cheat you like ludicrous. Move. Get out the way. you like King Julian in Madagascar you better move it move it around the outside like Eminem around the outside of the traffic and up the mountain past the Supra to the lead and using the SUV to help me turn better Ooh, little contact on the inner wall there going back outside near miss gentle scrape back down the mountain towards the dam and across the line under a minute 15 that was good stuff color me impressed keep it up kid the only person to do it in under a minute 15 at that all right wheel segment and that'll wrap it up for day five of the Lamborghini Countach LP 5K QV Proving Grounds live event. We also got the 10 blueprints so we can stage up the car to four stars. And that means we can also go ahead. Well, we have nine and a half hours before day six is unlocked. But what we can do right now, we go into the garage, stage up the car, of course. That'll bump up the performance from 538 to roughly about 550 something. 556. So nearly 20 points of performance gained. Add the wheel segment right here. And then we can rebuild the wheels. 
557, rebuild the wheels. The biggest performance game will be right here. We're going to go ahead and swap out the turbo for a better turbo. Up to 582 now. Sell the old turbo because we won't need it anymore. And it is at its maximum for the time being. One other thing we can do, let's go ahead and hop into the Pro Store and see what type of materials we can obtain. So quick refresh in the store. Let's do one more just to be on the safe side. So really nothing we can grab using the money. So we're not going to worry about it right now. So that'll wrap it up for this episode. Tune in next time for episode 267 for some more of the Lamborghini Countach LP 5K QV Proving Grounds live event day six part one like and subscribe for more content also for motorsports and gaming content i'll leave links to different channels in the description ladies and gentlemen it's your boy wonder brother with a special guest brandon here yo it was a good uh, episode and we'll see y'all next time peace